so dear students now it's the time to have the good topic actually every topic is a very good topic but yes this topic is really easy because because we have the vector part and we have done the vector part uh, in our class uh, in our class 12th also and also in our engineering so let's start the game with the vector calculus so i'm writing here vector vector calculus so let us have the basic introduction for vector calculus so it is our chapter number 4 my dear students we have done with the linear algebra differential equation then the integral and differential calculus then it is the vector calculus in vector calculus we will study the uh, basics of vector first basics of vectors correct so basics of vectors and we'll have the vector differential calculus vector differential calculus and also vector integral calculus so my dear students what is the basics of <coughs> vector calculus the basics of vector is what in our class we have done with the uh, the uh, magnitude right the dot product cross product the scalar triple product the determinant style right so all these things like uh, perpendicular vectors orthonormal vectors orthogonal vectors so this is what our basics of vector calculus so this is nothing but in our class 12 we have these labels right now what is vector differential calculus so vector differential in, in vector differential calculus we have the derivative term so derivative is nothing but the del operator so what we are having is with the help of del operator what is del operator del operator is nothing but del is equal to i del by del x plus j del by del y plus k del by del z so this is nothing but del operator correct now if i am having the del operator like this so if it is an operator we have the operations also so operations so what are the operations if i am having the if i am having the general product then it is operation so we are basically having the product right so the operations are nothing but gradient and related operation with gradient is nothing but directional derivative directional derivative for mechanical and civil and or chemical or production the gradient directional derivative and especially vector differential calculus is really very important for mechanical civil chemical etc the uh, vector differential calculus is very very important also the integral part but yes okay so gradient directional derivative divergence so i'm writing here divergence and also curl so these are the applications of the del operator or operations of the del operator so in operation we have done with this uh, we will done with this uh, we will do this kind of uh, uh, topics i mean we'll have the gradient directional derivative divergence and curl right so i will going to teach you the basics of uh, this the physical significance also and how can we evaluate this right so we will have okay now in vector integral calculus we should have the line integral the concept of line integral first then the concept of surface integral second and also after line and surface we should have the volume integral so my dear students if i am having the line surface and volume integrals concept then we will have the theorems which is nothing but the relationship which is nothing but the uh, relationship the theorems right so if i am having the theorems number one is a stoke theorem related with exactly same is nothing but as a green theorem and again we are having what the surface to volume this is nothing but gauss divergence theorem or gauss theorem i am writing here gauss theorem right gauss theorem so this is nothing but the syllabus this is the introduction of introduction of what vector calculus so let's start with the red color this is nothing but the basics of our vector calculus so after basics we'll apply the basics in see 
what is the this, this is nothing but the sequence right after ge getting the concept from the basics we should or we can have or we are able to uh, have or we are we are able to calculate the uh, directional derivative gradient divergence and curl because this is the basic is related with that products right so products is related with the vector differential calculus right so we if we learn the product then we can apply the product with the del operator with the scalar point function and vector point function that is results the gradient directional derivative divergence and curl so that's it okay now after having the knowledge of the gradient directional derivative divergence and curl we will go the relationship right because in a stroke theorem we need the uh, what we can say the concept of curl in green again the concept of curl also and in Gauss theorem we need to have the concept of divergence. So first of all we should have the basic so that we can have the gradient divergence and curl style and after that we will do the theorem that is nothing but the relationship which is related with the divergence and curl. So dear students let us start with the next video I am dealing with the basics of vector. So, what is the style to have the basics of vector, then we will have the question, then vector differential calculus, this all, then we will have the questions and again the vector integral calculus and then we have the final questions of booklet and workbook and then or your practice part. So, we will we'll complete this topic uh, in very uh, what we can say few hours. So, let us start the game, let us begin the game with the basics of vector calculus in our next video.